forward and tell me, please. What the hell was that? I'm probably more scared of the flipping spiders on me than I am the flipping whatever ghosts are in here. Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, as you can probably see from behind me, I am back. Back at what we dubbed last time and didn't disappoint. The UK's Blair Witch Woods. A bit different this time. I am completely alone. Um, I am not going to lie, I am pretty nervous, but I'm doing it, I'm doing it for you, I'm doing it for me, I'm doing it for the channel, but it's going to be a rocky night, I haven't got a clue what to expect being on my own. Last time it was pretty active, but there was three of us. So nerves are a bit high. Let's just do this. I haven't got a clue what to expect, guys. I know it's very muddy. Very, very muddy. A lot of cow pets. But... We're not here for that. Oh, spider webs, man. I had Jace last time here. I had Jace last time to help me out with the spider webs. Oh, spider webs are everywhere. Absolutely everywhere. Probably more scared of the flipping spiders on me than I am the flipping whatever ghosts are in here. Oh. Shit a brick. I hate that bit. Oh so right listen. I am already on edge because I'm alone. Uh, my heart is, is actually quite racing. And I've just heard a pig squeal. <laughs> so yeah, that wasn't, that wasn't a nice experience hearing the pig squeal, if I'm honest. 
Um, I think I'm going to stop recording just for the second until I get deeper in because uh, I don't want any pigs squealing and it being on camera and anyone trying to say I'm passing off squ pigs squealing as, as spirits because anyone that knows this channel knows we will try and debunk anything we can first before calling it paranormal. Um, yeah, so I'm going to uh, stop recording for now and I'll start recording again when I get a bit further up. Right, I'm was that? Oh, it's unnerving looking through that. Oh, it's really, really unnerving. What was this? Why is there a tag staple to the truck? Um, if anyone knows why there's a tag stapled to the tree, please do drop it in the comments because I'm quite curious. You bastard! Them stupid pigs! I gotta get out of it. I gotta get away from this freaking these pig bits. They're driving me mad. They keep grunting and making noises and. Just shitting me up basically. So once I get away from the pigs I'll start doing some call outs and see. See if I can catch anything. I've got minimum, minimum gear on me tonight. I didn't want to bring a bag full of stuff just in case. Just in case I came across anybody being on my own. It's a bit it's a bit vulnerable, isn't it? because I don't care who you are and how well you can handle yourself. You come across a gang of lads or a gang of people and they want to take your stuff and you're on your own. They're taking it. And I don't know these woods well enough to say that's not gonna happen. I'm already taking a chance bringing the camera and that in here. But yeah, I've got very minimal stuff. I've got two cat balls, a K2, a thermal imaging camera, and what else did I bring? Oh yeah, the EVP machine. So it's a bit nerve-wracking, but I'm getting there. I've been walking for about 15 minutes so far. So we're getting a bit further, a bit deeper into the forest now. We are, we are staying virtually on the trails tonight, guys, because I don't want to be in here all night, if I'm honest. I don't want to get lost. Somebody shows him. It's definitely. It was a man, a man's voice.
Right, so. That was definitely 100% a man's voice shouting. So, let's think about it logically, like we do to start with. What could it be? It could be people here. I haven't seen any people. I mean, they're not here. I haven't. There was no cars. There was no cars when I pulled up. My car was the only one in that whole line. So what else is wrong? that that was a bird that was definitely a bird because it flapped its way through the tree but what the fuck was that scream I'm going to go a bit further up and then make myself like a little base camp. Now, just for the record, it does say at the start, at the front gate, that if the red light is on, there will be military in here. <sighs> but that red light wasn't on today. It was on the last time we came here, but we didn't get shot at. But it's not on now. So I think and hope that I am completely alone in these woods, apart from all these frigging spiders. Such a long way to walk.
Oof, look. Really walking straight through the mud. A bird. I'm going to think logically, well I'm going to try, about any noises I hear, knowing full well that there is a lot of wildlife around. So I will see first if I can debunk. So there's no red light on that either. Right, so I'm at the crossroads now. Now I believe I went. I believe last time we turned to the right. Imagination might be going a bit mad now. Imagination. I don't actually know why. Right, I don't know why, but I don't know. This is this is how much. This is how much the emotional aspect and the psychological aspect gets you. I had a little tiny barbed wire fence running next to me all the way up that last path. For some reason it felt safer, even though it's just one little wire running across. It just, but it just felt so much safer. I get such a horrible vibe from this forest. Right. So this is about where I was last time. There, I can see the brick buildings just up there. So, because I'm surrounded by woodland I'm going to set up here and spend as long as I possibly can here before I get before I lose my bottle Here we go. Spirits! 
Call in any spirits that reside here. Come out and talk to me, please. Use your voice into this camera. It will hear you. I honestly can't tell you how uneasy. I've never done this completely on my own, never. This is a very, very first for me. Not just for the channel, but for me as well. Never done it. So. Well, I was going to do an EVP. Spirits, this tape machine that I'm using in my hand will pick up your voice if you wish it to do so. Please come and tell me your name. Tell me if you're a male or a female. Do you think you could tell me your age? Was that you I just heard bang? Or by those buildings? Come forward and tell me please. in my hand will pick up your voice if you wish it to do so please come and tell me your name tell me if you're a male or a female tell me your age oh, you I just heard bang or by those buildings. Forward and tell me, please. What? What's that? Tell me your age. There was something at the end then. Oh, you, I just heard bang. Or by those buildings. Forward and tell me, please. Your age? What was it in the end? You, I just heard bang. Or by those buildings. Forward and tell me, please. Okay. What the hell was that? I can hear dogs, so I'm hoping there's not. There may be someone walking the dog in there. So eerie. I can hear an aeroplane above as well.
Come forward, please, spirits, and show yourself to the camera. I'm not here to hurt you. I come in love, peace and respect. It's not my intention to, to hurt you or anything. Fuck me, that sounds like someone walking up there. bit further. Going up a 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 bit further. These trees in here are just growing so strange. I can't find... I can't claim, right? I can't claim that I find the way trees are growing uh, scary, okay? That's not what I'm saying. It's just... This place is so... Freaking horrible. I'm just on edge, guys. I'm really, really on edge. Um, what the fuck is that?
Okay, so my mind is playing a few tricks because I've just heard what I thought was a moan from behind me. Then I heard it again and it was a motorbike. So, no moan. This is further than we went up last time, guys. Now, so, the gang, the Dreadmare gang, have sent me a picture of some sort of area inside this place. And it's supposed to have like an altar stone So I've been walking now past the brick huts for a while and I can't see anything that I could say look like what they've sent me on the pictures. I haven't seen anything off the beaten track. Fuck's sake. Spirit? Was that you? Does that look? Something's moving in there. What sort of animals live in here? Spirit, is that you? Is that you I can hear moving through this? Okay, right, so I've reached a gate that states that it's a military firing range, but it's open. Spirit, come forward and show yourself, please. Come and show yourself to the camera. Oh. 
What the hell was that? Is there somebody there? That was a scream. Who's screaming? Are you screaming because you need help? Guys, that was a full-on scream. Like... Like... I've never heard... a scream that loud... on an investigation... ever before. I really hope the camera caught that. Come on, spirit, come and show yourself. I'm not here to hurt you. I'm not here to hurt you or destroy anything. Don't even want to make a nuisance of myself. I just want to talk. I just want to communicate with you. Just want to find out who's screaming and if they're safe or they need help. Who screamed? Who screamed, please, spirit? I know there's what I know. There's spirits here. I can feel ya. You may as well just come out and show yourself. Come on. You don't need to be quiet. I'm giving you permission. Flipping out, this is hard work going down the hill. Spirits, come on, please. I'm not coming in there to find you because I don't want to get lost. So you're going to have to come to me. You think that's a good idea?
all my dice. Now this is getting a bit horrible to be around. Shit. Spirit, is that you? Come on. I know I'm a bit edgy. I know I'm a bit jumpy. But honestly, you're allowed to come forward. You can come and talk to me. Spirit, I can hear somebody moving around. You don't have to stay hidden. You can come out of the shadows. Come and stand in the middle of the road. Come on. Or just show yourself from behind a tree. Right, back to where the trail is for the brick buildings. Spirit, the last team that came here, that wasn't us, I don't know if you remember me, but I have been here before and introduced myself. I will introduce myself again. My name is Mike. I'm not here to hurt you. But the last team that came here heard your voice. Do you think I can hear your voice, please? Right guys, it is worth noting as well that the path that I'm walking on is gravel, okay? So it is worth noting that while I'm walking, if you do hear like a shuffling noise or like a dragging noise, there is gravel underneath my feet. So, yeah, listen, there's, that's, that's gravel. I can't show you because it doesn't pick up very well on the IR. I can try. So there's stones, there's dirt, there's yeah, it's just gravel, gravel underneath my feet. So I might be kicking stones around, I might be dragging stuff through. So really all I want you to do really is don't listen to any noises unless it's a voice as I'm walking around. Only put it in the comments down below if there's any noises that you hear when I'm stood still like this because I'm completely stood still right now, just looking around, I'm at a junction. That was movement from down that way then, but I think I heard it be as it being a bird.
ignore the smoke, that's my vape. Because I vape more when I get nervous. I think that is just birds. I'm pretty sure that is just birds. In fact, I think I'm gonna I'm gonna confidently confidently say that's birds. I don't really want to stay still too long. But this junction here feels really uneasy. Like really uneasy. Down there feels horrible. I hope I am getting it across just how unsettling and unnervy and jumpy this place makes you. Um, I can't help thinking there's something here. I've been here a good hour and a half and I've heard Hearing noises everywhere, man. Hearing noises. I've debunked what I can debunk. Um, things like birds and that. But there's, there's been a couple of screams. Like really, really loud screams. And unless unless there's people in here but unless there's people in here that I don't know about and they're screaming every now and again for no reason I don't know I really really don't know Like I said before, this is a first for me. Being on my own, in a haunted forest, in what is essentially the middle of the night. Um, have I enjoyed it? I have, yeah, I have. I've enjoyed it. Um, it's freaking eerie. It's scary. Fair play to uh, Stu from Paranormal Walks. Because he does this all the time on his own in the, in the forest. Um, just him and the dog. If you haven't seen Stu 
from Paranormal Walks videos. Um, go and check him out. The link will be in the description. But yeah, fair place, Joe. Don't know how you do it, mate. Every freaking, every time on your own. I don't mind doing it every now and again, but I wouldn't want to do this on my own all the time. So fair play to you. Here's my little fence that I like. I don't know why. It just makes me feel a little bit, just a tad bit safer. And I don't understand why, because look, there's nothing to it. It's just a line of barbed wire out of post. But psychologically, the, the I don't know why. Just psychologically, the um, the comfort that that one little barbed wire fence gives me is unreal. I don't know whether this is because it's this is a completely completely new experience for me. Um, it is it is a completely new experience. trying to communicate just it feels feels like feels like I'm being played with being toyed with It's like, it's like whatever's here knows I'm here, knows I want it to show itself. Make it. Oh, I'm back with an earshot of pigs now. Oh. So yeah. Um. I am back within earshot of the pigs. So I can completely debunk sort of any noise I hear from now on. So do you know what guys, I'm gonna, uh, because I can now debunk everything I hear as being either them pigs or birds, because there's tons of trees above me as well. I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna end the video there. So, <sighs> freaking pigs. Right, guys. So, if you did enjoy that video, please do consider subscribing to the channel. Um, I've gone out my comfort zone here tonight. Gone to a haunted woods on my own. Um, that's a pig. Pig shouting at me. Doesn't sound nice though. Um, doesn't sound nice. And it's now got me wondering whether that was a pig earlier on that I heard. I mean, I know I was a lot further down. A lot further in, I mean. Um, but sound does travel. So, I don't know. So on that bombshell, I am going to end this video. Uh, if you did like that video, please do consider subscribing to the channel. Um, drop it a like. Stick a comment in, in the comment section down below. And I will catch you on the next one.